WhatsApp introduced a new feature called Communities. And I am here to help you get started in just a few simple steps. You might be wondering, how is a WhatsApp group different from communities? With communities, you can easily bring all your groups together in one place and manage conversations between multiple groups. To get started, make sure to update your WhatsApp to the latest version. Step one, on your phone, open WhatsApp. Tap on the new communities tab and select start a community. Next, fill out all the information. Type your community name, add a description to showcase what your community is about. Make your community easily recognizable by adding a community icon. You can choose take photo, choose photo, or search web to add an image. Once done, tap next. To add groups to your community, you can either create a new group or Add your existing groups by selecting which groups to add. Tap add and then create. An announcement group will be automatically created for your community. This is a special group within the community where only admins can send messages. Any text you send to the announcement group will be broadcasted to all members of every individual group. WhatsApp Communities also includes a new feature called Focused Chats. This allows admins to create smaller, more focused discussions within the larger community. Now it's time to invite more members. Go to your community and select View Members. You can either invite members through your community link or generate a QR code for others to join. And that's it. Your new WhatsApp community has been created. Communities bring people together who share common interests and create a space for discussions and engagement between members. WhatsApp Communities is a convenient way to manage your groups and grow your own community.